Well, hello, good evening to you as we join together here for what will be the last step on the road to qualification for the grandest of all the competitions in European club football. Teams here right on the edge of the elite. Players from both clubs return to work early to be in prime shape for this. This a potentially season-defining moment, despite the fact that we are still only in late summer. So red and white, of course, the preeminent colours at Old Trafford, which is now officially the largest club football ground in England. Its capacity 75,000 and growing. An air of unease. We all know what's at stake here, do we not, Jim? Yes, and if you want success on a European front, Peter, you must be able to live with the pressure. This is a means to uh, a significant uplift in, in finances that can benefit these players and, and obviously attract better. It has huge potential consequences in a positive sense for all concerned. Things on the way. Sancho is making his first appearance for his new team today. What can we look forward to seeing from him, Jim? Well, this is a player who's always capable of conjuring up that little moment of magic, Peter. He only needs an instant to make a difference with a killer pass or a telling run. And that's the kind of thing you need to unlock defences. Looks a good ball. Sancho. Sancho hits that long. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Well, he's made sure that that won't get through. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And the defence can get it clear. Bruno Fernandes. got the better of him this time but I'm sure he'll go again he'll have a go and here's in for the follow up and it's Pogba has a look and has a go good first touch and almost as good a second ah that's a great effort there was very little backlift to indicate what was coming He's left his man. Pretty robust, but it's got the job done. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. There's a long ball. Well positioned to make that shot at goal! Manchester United! Well, 
against there ever any doubt. Well, how's that for composure, Peter? You can see the keeper tried to put as much pressure on him by staying upright, but it didn't phase him, not in the slightest. United take the lead, 1-0. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Crosses into the box. Time to deliver. Gets wrestled off the ball. Bruno Fernandes, Bruno Fernandes with a long pass. Sancho has a goal! It's a goal! And they're at it again in double quick time! He was urged to shoot, and he truly delivered. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. United got themselves a two-goal cushion. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Stade Rene getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Yang desperately wants to get on the end of this. Juan Bissaka lobs it in gently. Forward it goes. Manchester United are in control here on the brink of half-time. Gets away from his opponent. Gets the power of his man. Martial showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Yang. Yang. Good ball, it's one! Oh, taken with style! With half time at hand! Perfect timing! Oh, high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. That Rene get themselves back into contention. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Oh, sweet feet. Keeper's ball. Guilty party there. Niang. Niang. Niang! 
He scores! Oh, listen, the writing was on the wall. It looked like this was going to happen, and it has. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, for me, you can't fault the keeper there. The effort went in at the widest possible point off the upright. Nothing he could do. This. And there's the end of the first half. Manchester United playing their part in a real slugfest here. A glut of goals and nothing to suggest much is going to change. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals. And I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Terrific half, four goals split evenly, beautifully set up for the second period to follow. Stad René kick off the second half. Alex Tell, the referee's awarded a free kick. Rashford, balls out on the left, now goes long. He's through. Speculative strike. And that will sail harmlessly past. Sancho put absolutely everything he had into that. Maybe better look next time. Sonzi. Bruno Fernandes did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Juan Bissaka. Towering head! He's done it! And that has only enhanced his already huge reputation. They were obviously hoping for an early second half boost, but there are a few who can truly make it happen. And this is a very welcome tonic now. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. United go into the lead. And he's away. Kick ball forward. A real chance to break. Good challenge. He just stood firm. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful, but they have to give him a harder time like that. And here's Rashford. Goes for goal! And he's there to hoof it away. It's a promising run he's making on the right. Sancho pumps it into the area.
Goes direct to the front line. Rashford. Has he picked him out? And he's there to cut it out. Gets good distance on it. Throw in. Tries to get it forward quickly. He goes long. Tries a shot! Oh, the kick has gone ever so well. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. He's played it short. Keeps everyone guessing. He certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. score no that was a slick move and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out <laughs> and towards the front men Sancho clips one through. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. And it's Niang. Real chance! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. That Rene are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. He came in hard, very hard. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. from the placement. <laughs> Manchester United and two up and into a position of real strength. Fires from distance. It's off target and by quite a way. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. <laughs> Try 
needs to get it forward quickly. Now it's Martial. Good ball. Face to face. That's a hit! Manchester United are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's the clever use of counter attacking. That's the real highlight. That Rene making consecutive changes here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. So now the difference is three. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Martin. Niang. De Ligt drives it forward. Four extra minutes added on. He's through, now is he in? Out to the left it goes. Forward it goes. Sancho plays it long. Back to the keeper and tries something new. Away from immediate danger. And it's Martin. Sancho. So that's it. It is all over. Manchester United. They had to win at home. And win they did. And it's they who take the initiative and head on to opposition territory on the front foot. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Manchester United simply imposed their strength from start to finish, and this became as predictable as predicted.